Today, in the European Union, any product resulting from genetic editing techniques is strictly treated as GMO or genetically modified organism. GMOs are all subjected to legislation from 2001 which acts as a ban. However, in the last 20 years, new genetic techniques have emerged. For this reason, in April 2021, a study commissioned by the European Commission proposed a revision of this policy. Two techniques might be excluded from the GMO definition. Target mutagenesis, in which deliberate changes occur without inserting external genetic material, and cisgenesis, in which changes happen by inserting genetic material from plants that can cross in nature. More applications are expected to emerge in upcoming years as new genomic techniques are an important ally in reducing the environmental impact of agricultural production. New genetic techniques can make plants resistant to pests and diseases, requiring fewer chemical pesticides, for example, a fungi-resistant maize or increase resistance to harsh environments, for example, a rain-resistant wheat or drought-tolerant rice, or even produce more yield in standard conditions, optimizing the use of limited resources such as soil and water. These innovative crops that are more sustainable and resilient to their rapidly changing environments will be crucial for the demands of tomorrow's food production, helping us in the fight for climate change.